What's up, everybody? Welcome to the shop. I hope all y'all are having a good Thanksgiving. Today's Thanksgiving. We just got full and fat, so we're getting ready to uh, work on the race car. We out here in the shop. We're about to take the motor out. Yesterday, Pa and David, they got all the accessories out. Transmission, headers, distributor, carburetor, all that good stuff is out of the car. So here in just a minute, we getting ready to strap the hoist up to it, pull it out, and I'm gonna show y'all all that. So uh, like I said yesterday, Pa and David done all that work and uh, David was the man and time lasted for me because I was at home working on the video that just came out. Hopefully today is processing right now, but um, I'm gonna show y'all that time lapse. So here it is. Dave's doing some cleaning right now. Yes, sir. Got that purple power out. What's going on, purple power? Yes, sir, son. And it's right here. So you can't beat it. But anyway, we got us a brand new, a brand used Burt transmission there. With that good old purple power cleaned it right on up. We need a new radiator, bro. I'm getting one tomorrow right. awesome. morning. That's what's up. Because that radiator's about had it, mate. It has about had it. That thing's got more. Hey, man, ask what? anybody how to do, they, do they know what goes on here? Hey, if all our racing fans out there or racers, we yeah. we replaced our radiator hose about in the middle of the season. And this happened once before, and the whole darn spring sits in there like that is inside of the radiator. And then we just took this off just a minute ago, and the same thing's happening. So if any of y'all know why the in the trouble. heck that's doing that, if y'all had the same trouble, let us know what's what's going on with that. Do we need to use different hoses or what is it? Let us know. Cause we I think it might be it's flowing too we, fast. We sure like to know. I think it might be because it flows too fast. Yeah. It actually sucks it out of here once it gets hot. It probably does. I ain't no telling, man. But I mean, that's just a part, part house hose too, so it could just be cheap mess. Probably. I ain't no telling, but uh, you never know. That could be a reason for our overheating. Pro probably not. But that. you never know. Man, ain't, no, <laughs> <laughs> ain't nobody yeah, worried about that. Yeah, they did that in a Facebook marketplace. Yeah. They, Covered or tag. Yeah. <laughs> oh, let me see. This is how they do it. Don't look at that, guys. Anyways. I'll steal my tag. <laughs> yeah. Don't be looking up where we live at now. But, uh... Yeah, like I said before, Pa and David gave, stripped it all down yesterday. Y'all just seen that time lapse, so uh show y'all what it looks like now. Transmission gone. Carburetor gone. Distributor. Headers. All we got is a couple engine mount bolts. And she's a coming out. 
and for everybody else out there at Grace's, we need to know. We got a question about your your, your start. We changed the solenoid, the wires, everything, ignition switch, battery, brand new, everything. Ground wire to the starter, ground wire to the solenoid, and the thing just run, run. You know, it lugs the crank. So if yeah. anybody knows about that, hit us up. It's been rough with us this year. Every time, like we'll, we, like when we first get to the track, it, it'll fire up fine. Everything's fine. And then we get out, go hot lap, come back, and go to crank it for qualifying. And it's like, rah, 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 and it takes forever to get it started. So that's another question for you know, all the racers out there. What could that possibly be? Cause it's pretty much stumping us. We we can't figure it out. But um, we've done everything. We've done everything. Just like David said, we've rewired it. We've changed starters. We have took the starter apart. Put a new put a new brushes. Put new, put new brushes in it. All everything, man, and it still does it. Still does the same crap. It's aggravating. Cause especially when we're out on the track during the race, and somebody in front of us spins out. And David does the the switcher witcher witcher and and dodges it and the red flag comes out and we're sitting there on the track for three days and he cuts it off. Then it won't crank back because we're sitting there and Wait. Jeep the gym man Jeep has got to come save us. And that's aggravating. We want to start our start our car up on our own and roll out. That's right. That's right. No help needed. No help needed. Hit that button and ride. But we promise, if y'all don't have any suggestions, we will figure it out. Oh, yeah, we'll figure it out. We never give up. That's yeah. one thing about B&M Motorsports. We never give up. Heck, yeah. We're going to change the name next year. B&M. Yeah, because the M could stand for Mumford and Murray. Baker, Mumford, or Murray. B and M Motorsports. And how about y'all y'all leave a bunch of comments and tell Pa to let's put this motor in our other race car so I can drive it. <laughs> yeah. Add him on Facebook as a friend, Richard Mumford, and message him. Or, matter of fact, post it on his timeline and tell him to do it. Hashtag. He don't his messages. He's an old guy. Hashtag <laughs> let Chuck drive. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's it. Hashtag Chuck's got the fever. I do. I really got it. I'm itching to race. <laughs> I really want it bad. It would be so nice. It would be great. Been trying to get David to let me drive this one just for like practice. practice or something but he acts like i'm gonna Gold. destroy it or something Gold. knowing that i'm gonna be going like five mile an hour the whole time because i'll be scared to tear it up <laughs> <laughs> we might put you in there next year for a couple of practice laps I wish they Tried I out. wish they still did uh, I want real most of the thing I wanted to do was get all the tweaks out of yeah. it and get it to where because practice laps and hot laps and qualifying and all that really counted this year. Oh yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I mean, I know. We had to have every lap that we could. Especially it's, especially with the way the car act, you know, yeah. acted up the first cup part of the year and all that. So we needed all the R and D we guys. needed super trash guys yeah if anybody can afford a gasket for four four bolt i mean a four barrel carburetor please send us one to <laughs> three, four, three. i don't believe i'm gonna put that in there dog because uh we might have all the fans at the house <laughs> that's okay they're welcome they can come on down here come on down we'll teach y'all everything we know come on down Hey, 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 since we brought that up, we ain't got no sponsors for the car. And obviously, y'all see the videos on YouTube. 
I'm trying to get us out there. If there's anybody out there that would like to sponsor Month for Racing, hit us up. Cause uh, or even just sponsor Chucky with the, the YouTube, cause that'll help us yeah. a lot. Yeah. Either if y'all, we need some sponsors for the car, and I and we need some sponsors for the channel. So e either way, anything. Else. If y'all want to sponsor the race car, hit us up. We'll love to have you. Anything helps. Anything helps. Thanks. Oh, Gerald was was going to give us a little sponsor, but he he decided to go get his own car and just said bump bumped him boys. <laughs> I'm just playing, Gerald. You the man. <laughs> yeah, he's really playing because we def we definitely know how much it costs to run a race car. Oh yeah. So we know we understand why he done that. Yeah. We no hard feelings, man. We still love you. I know that's right. Look at all that freedom. Look at all this freedom, y'all. Nothing, nothing but freedom. Eagle flying through the sky. Caca! Where'd Pago? He abandoned us. Is he? David done changed his shirt, but he was repping it. But look at Pa repping the channel today. What do you mean? Today. Well, he went ahead and drained the oil out of it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, David had his shirt on too, but check out Pa repping the channel today. I didn't want to get oh, yeah. <laughs> He's the man. Pa, your stomach full from Thanksgiving? Ooh, yeah. I'm about to bust, man. It's, it's night night time now. Run, don't tighten it all the way down, just run it in. Yeah, but I still got this part. <clears throat> then why'd you why'd you switch sides then? Because that side's closer than this side. Oh, okay. Well, why don't you take that out then? I am right now. It looks like it's already no. So he ain't chain it. it. Might feed it to get it out of there. Hey, old son. Now we in business. We in business. Old Stephen Martin. Old Steven might see see our question and let us know something in the comments. See, I'm just gonna leave this motor just like this. Well, are we gonna tear it down today? Not today. Oh. But unless, well, we can take the intake off of it, the heads, probably. It don't take about 15 minutes, and that's all that off. Yeah. That's I'll, it. I'd like to do that. See what she look like, mate. Well, get the jacking helmet. All right, let's get the jacking helmet set you guys up here. I really hope this chain works. I think it will, mate.
tell I'm good at that. <laughs> that. That good forearm strength. Yeah. <laughs> Well, I got a bolt about the size of that in there. That should hold it, hasn't it? A little bit longer, a little bit shorter than that. Oh, that's a good one. Yeah. Over just a little bit up that way. This here out right up, we could have just sat it right down on the floor. Slid it out, couldn't we? <laughs> Lays apart. Mm -hmm. Go ahead, as long as it don't get to bouncing there, it'll be alright. If it gets to bouncing, you're gonna have to slow it down. Well, I remember one day I went back there to the ball and me and Denise and this big old black snake coming running out of there. Boy, it scared that girl to death. It took me two days to catch her. Who <laughs> <laughs> did? Your mama. Oh. She a little <laughs> 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 All right, you starting to clear your frame rail now? Your oh, yeah. nose piece? We there? All right, let's start sliding back a little bit. Get it on the back of the air. You gotta be easy with this thing. Mm -hmm. Flip over. Right, if we can get it over here to the side, it'll be better. Come on. Which way? Come on, just come straight back. It'll pull itself. About a foot off the ground. Good. Yeah. Got it. There it is, y'all. The box of freedom is out. All eight eagles. All right, y'all, we got the motor out, so uh, we're going to clean it up a little bit, and then later in a little bit, once we start tearing it down, I'll bring y'all back.
making a miss, Paul. And then once you get done with them, hold up, Paul, hold up, hold on. Let me get you a bag here. Yeah. I don't have to push all day. I don't know. Go ahead and put them in this bag while you got them out. Do the, the push rods ain't got to go on the same side? Well, I was gonna try to put it back the same way it come apart. It was running good that way, so. Where you want these at, David? In this box? <clears throat> yeah. I'll take one of these head boats out on the bottom and lean this block and drain some more water out of it. Come on out, bud. Well, there goes the Work. rockers, y'all. Got the rockers off. And Pa's about to break the head bolts. Now we need to Big pa. And that's a three quarter. Yeah. I got it, Pa. She peeing. We did take this out. Here's slap about to come off there. Put it on the bottom. Look. Well, we'll bring our back 
blow up. We'll bring out back when we get the heads off. All right, y'all, we got the heads off. Everything looks good. We had a stuck uh, a lifter, so we had to take the oil pan and the cam. the cam out. So we got it stuck lifter out. We don't know why it was stuck, but everything looks good. All our bearings look good because we checked the cap a rod bearing. We ain't checked any main bearings yet, but as of right now, everything looks good. Two and that's two years of racing on this engine so we were expecting to find something but we didn't find anything everything turned out all right so there's that hope y'all like the video thank you for watching and we'll see y'all next time peace out